What is going on you guys? It's your girl Diana back at you with another YouTube video. Today we have a brand new Pokemon Scarlet and Violet trailer and this one's a long one so let's go ahead and hop into this. I feel like it needs no further explanation and if you're new here take the next few seconds to hit the subscribe button because it helps you girl out and of course give this video a thumbs up if you are a Pokemon fan so that we can push it out into the YouTube algorithm so that more Pokemon fans can see the trailer. And if you would like another way to support the channel feel free to check out the merch store. I have all kinds of fun stuff on there from hoodies to hats to joggers. There is a link down below in the description that takes you to my link tree which not only leads you to the merch store but also to all my other socials so you can make sure that you're keeping up to date with what I'm doing on a daily basis but let's hop into the newest trailer okay this is a long one it's 14 minutes long so hopefully we get some good right, info everyone. in here it's almost time to begin your journeys in the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon can you believe that this is literally like ready? less you than a month or a month them. away from being released not bad okay I feel like they're gonna give us some good info in this because it is so long maybe we'll get some middle evolutions because that's what I'm hoping for so I can see what Sprigatito is gonna turn into <laughs> an independent study program okay called well why are we this is giving uh naruto flashbacks because why are we already going over information that we already have you probably knew all that already oh <laughs> she's like girl i i hear you i got you a sneak peek at four particular trainers journeys in Haldea. okay now the chonk the god of pokemon is here this Quaxley! Place. Look at how little Quaxley is! I like the way that like all of the like menus and everything look in this game. Looks clean. Oh no! Poor Quaxley. We're actually getting like real-time gameplay, which I like because I feel like we haven't gotten like real-life gameplay where we see what it's like to do it like without any cuts or edits or anything. Look at our boy! Beautiful. Gorgeous. <laughs> like that one guy on TikTok. Oh. Okay. What's that over there? What is that? Is that a glowing Pokemon? Why is it glowing? It seems to be a Jigglypuff. Uh, but why is it shining so bright? I don't know. You tell me, lady. Freaking Dora the Explorer, Dora the Exploring me right now. Oh. It's a oh. Has the water type okay, so I guess you can run into Terrastal Pokemon not only in raids, but I guess in the wild too. So you don't only have to get them in raids. Interesting concept. Okay. I wonder how common that would be, though. It's got the water terra type. Pretty tough. But Quaxley's strong too. <laughs> Dealing enough damage to a wild terra Pokemon causes its terrastalization to come undone. Interesting. Do you, I wonder if like you have to do that in order to try to catch the terra or terrastalized Pokemon? Like, do you have to get it to unterastalize to catch it? Or can you catch it while it's terastalized? Many thoughts. Many thoughts. I really liked the way that menu looked, by the way. Oh, we're about, we're squaring up. Look at him go! <laughs> okay, this is the let's go feature, okay. Because the trainer gave Quaxley. Oh my gosh. I actually like this feature. I think it's <laughs> I think it's cool. Send your lead Pokemon out onto the field to battle. And they can like pick up items and stuff too. They don't only fight Pokemon. If a Pokemon gets sent out toward an item, it'll go pick it up. Oh, literally. <laughs> That's sick. For searching your surroundings. These Pokemon are so helpful, giving their all for their partner. Honestly, yes. now that I see yeah, Quaxley in the game, it's actually really cute. Wants to go. It was probably like my least favorite, but now seeing it like run around, I like it. Destination to keep yourself on track as you go. Then we can hop atop the legendary Pokemon. <laughs> Honestly, Island that looks kind of sick. Go. I'm not gonna lie, he's just straight up riding a motorcycle. To Team Star, the school troublemaker. Starfall Street. Okay, one of the Team Star. That will make up your what else are we finding out about well, Team Star that we don't already know since we've gone over them like 20 times? Time to face Team Star. Starfall Our Street. Our trainer rang the bell and barged into the base. That takes some guts. 
Okay, here's our here's our big battle scenes that we have with the Team Star grunts where you use the Let's Go feature, which I think is kind of cool. There we go. Wiglet, Wiglet out here like let me make my debut. Are we gonna? Are they gonna finally announce this is actually a Pokemon because it literally has a mouth and eyes? Oh, a queen, an actual queen. Look at her go. I love her design. She looks so sick. She even got like the acrylics going on. Let's go. You'll have to wait for your own adventure to see how a battle like why they do me like that. They didn't even say anything. Rude. How's her adventure? Stringing me along. Make a TM. What? No way. Machine lets you make your own TM. Also known as technical That's machines. so cool. Using materials Pokemon drop when you defeat I them. like that. Okay, you literally make your own TMs and you have to like pick up items and stuff in order to make them. That's so cool. I like that. Dang. Now, where will she go next? Seems to be a desert like area under a blaze. Alright, here we go with Just looking at it is enough to make you freaking thirsty. cloth. Oh, her Rotom phone is ringing. Ring Sounds ring. Like Arvin. 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 The next grade up needs some help. Why you always need help, Arvin? To give Arvin a hand. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> I this like how it's like, oh, he can't path find path. it. It's just this a giant crab. Earth, okay. There it is. Herba Mystica. Drifloon. Look at, I love Drifloon. Right Drifloon's one of my favorite ghost types. Icy Wind. The move our trainer taught Drifloon earlier. Icy Wind lowered the Titan Cloth speed. Ooh, stack. what are we gonna turn it into? Drifloon terastalized. Why she say it like that? Drifloon. This is why. Why? Why was the? Why was the emphasis on the? The end of it. When the user is terastalized, it ought to be handy for a Pokemon with a. Honestly, honestly, I know a lot of people don't really like the hats, but I think they're kind of cool looking. I think they're kind of cute. Wait. To each their own, I guess. What are doing now of all times? Oh. Looks like we're trading. A break from adventuring to trade Pokemon with a friend. And Very nice. Her trade partner has received giraffe rig. Why are we focusing on giraffe rig? Look at how cute it is! And she's gonna let it in the field and train up for some battles. I feel like we might get an evolution. Is that why we're focusing so much on this thing? Yep, I well. Oh. Don't say I didn't tell y'all. Could giraffe rig be evolving? What is that? <laughs> he looks like a, a space cadet! Oh my god. Like giraffe rig has evolved for <laughs> It literally looks like a space cadet. Its tail turned into its head. What the heck? Oh, this Pokedex looks kind of cool though. What the heck? Let's That's sick. What's happening in the corner over here? Did, did anybody else just see that? Did anybody else see the like on the map? There was like a little cluster of Pokemon. I don't care about Victory Road, okay? We've talked about Victory Road enough, but I need to talk about what was going on on the map in the corner. Why was there Pokemon? What's happening? Oh, why some Flora look so glitchy? Better get started right away. Oh. Why does that look so bad? Wait, <laughs> wait, I hope that was like my computer and not the actual gameplay because that was, it was looking a little rough. It was looking a little giffy. Oh my gosh, okay. We already know about this guy. He's already been in the other trailers. This is our gym leader with the Sunfloras. Pseudo Wudo turning into a grass type. We've seen this. Are you gonna be okay, Fido? Fido. How's our trainer gonna handle this one? I like Fido. Cute little donut dog. Oh. What? Uh -huh. She's gonna Did that increase its speed? Interesting. Okay. And what's this thing's Terra type? Oh, he's flying. <laughs> Look at how cute that is. Okay, honestly, the people that don't like the hats, y'all are haters. That's cute. That is cute. No matter who or what you're up against, with some smart terrestrializing, you'll have nothing to fear. I can't wait to see how. Jeez, Fido is getting wrecked, low key, and they're just like, let's just cut it before Fido absolutely faints. 
This is our customization. They got some good hair choices, I'm not gonna lie. How are you supposed to choose? But like, are we gonna be able to change our clothes? Because what if I don't want to wear my uniform the whole time? Because that uniform, it's not it. It's not it. I don't like it. Oh, she got red eyes. Ooh, I like that you can like customize like the makeup and the eye shape. That's cute. I can give it my winged liner. You can take selfies! Oh, sprigatito! Oh my god, and it poses? A true queen or king. That's so funny. You can literally take selfies and then post it as your profile picture. It's literally like Snapchat. <laughs> Snapchat or Instagram. Oh, picnics! So this is like our campsite. Oh, you can give them baths. A nice scrub make sure they had, make nice sure that they're cool. nice and clean. Looks like it feels nice too. Before having lunch, is that a soccer ball? Some energy by playing with a ball. Where's where's Cinderace at? <laughs> Cinderace can play with the soccer ball. Okay, so we had curry and sword and shield. Are we an egg? Apparently, eggs can some. Is this a new breeding mechanic? Okay, so you can find eggs. You can find eggs when you're picnicking. Okay, this is like the curry. Okay, this is what I was talking about. <laughs> you can make a sandwich. I can make a mean sandwich. Oh, sandwich to make. This one may be a little overstuffed. Oh, it might not hold the. There is no such thing as a sandwich that's overstuffed, because I love sandwiches. That's all I have to say. I don't know where that thought was going, but I love sandwiches. <laughs> the little Evie pick. What? That's a. It had, it had like 10 minutes on the clock. Does it take a long time to make these sandwiches? It's kind of unfortunate. Eating sandwiches can give you benefits, like making certain types of Pokemon easier to catch or making your Pokemon. Okay, I mean, at least there's a good reason to make the sandwiches, even though they take a hot minute to make. Where to go next? Oh, hey, looks like more of our trainer friends have shown up. And then this is where you can play with like a group all of your right. friends. Take on a terror <laughs> Look at all these legendaries. Work together to defeat the Terra Pokemon. Oh, here's our raids. Okay, so this is our raid battles for the Terra Pokemon. Their opponent is a Chansey that's terrestrialized into a ghost. Ooh, ghost type Chansey. A strong, sparkling Chansey I still can't get over this space cadet over here. <laughs> He has no tail now, though. His tail quite literally turned into like a helmet or its head. Poor guy. Has no tail. It's really powerful. These trainers better stay determined, band together, and strike back. <laughs> it's like superheroes. Poor Sableye. I feel like this chance he's just like that Sableye. It's gotta go. If it has got to go. In a terror raid battle, don't worry. Okay, so if you get knocked out after it looked like five turns, you can respawn or be revived. Respawn? What? And you can cheer. What does cheering do? I guess it helps? Oh, it ra it raised their special attack and their attack. Okay, that's kind of cool. At least it's helpful. And defense. Oh, you can choose what it does? Interesting. Okay. I mean, at le yeah, at least cheering helps. Dude, poor Sableye. <laughs> Why are we picking on Sableye? Oh wow! That was a beautiful Terra Raid battle victory, and with it comes the Very chance nice. to catch this Terra Pokemon. When you join forces to win your does it give you different friends and balls Pokemon you can use? Because didn't you get Premier Balls? Or am I just thinking of Dynamax Adventures? I might be thinking of Dynamax Adventures. It's one of my favorite yeah, Pokeballs, though. The rare Terra type is now part of the team. So, what'd you think? Well, that was it? A look at these four we still teams. didn't get anything about the starters! I feel played. I feel like they're, like, they said a lot, but they also didn't. Like, they're really stringing this along. I have so many questions, but there was so much cool stuff that just got introduced. What you just saw was what the only heck? A of the only a gl I feel like there's so much more. I feel like they're they're like playing this one very close to the vest, and that like once everybody plays, it's gonna be like a bunch of cool stuff. More adventures are right around the corner. May they shine bright. That's it. Dang, that was a good that was a good trailer.
Wow, okay, very nice. I mean, yeah, that was sick. Like I said, I feel like they said a lot without saying a lot. And I'm honestly just, I really wish that we would get more info on the starters so I can see, cause I'm going with Sprigatito, so I wish I could see what it's gonna turn into at least for its middle stage. I'm not asking for the final reveal, but I just, uh, it's, it's uh, that's the only thing that's like stressing me out right now. <laughs> cause I wanna see if it's gonna look cool. But per usual, stay tuned. I'll definitely do a more of a deep dive and go onto the website and see if there's more info because there always is more info. So stay tuned for that video but hopefully you guys enjoyed this one and I'll see you guys in the next one. Love you guys. Bye.